can either believe it or they cannot believe it. I don't give two f but I am telling you right now, that mother f that mother f back there is not real. What's up, guys? It's your boy, Benny, TMF, INR. Say it back. You know what it means. That mf -er ain't real. Thank you, Tiffany Gomas, for giving us the banger of the summer. You explain to us that those mf -ers are not real, and we say thank you. We say thank you. Some people, some people see lizard people, and that's okay. And we say thanks to Tiffany Gomas. We have ID'd her this week. She's a marketing agent from Dallas. She is a real person. Here's like, for instance, a little ditty about her in a industry publication, Tiffany Gomas, Vice President, Client Services, Elevate Brand Marketing. So she works on like Xbox uh, uh, items and, and, and marketing for Microsoft. That's kind of cool. Great. She has a great relationship with her mother, so on and so forth. Um, and... She seems to be like a deeply uh, successful and grounded person, and we wish her all the best. Not trying to dox anyone, but we are trying to explore what actually happened here because this has truly taken the internet by storm, and there is a brand new video that has been posted of a very different angle. New video shows Tiffany Gomas acting erratically and demanding to leave her seat moments before she lost into the not real tirade. This new video shows Tiffany Gomas clearly in a state of extreme duress before th this angle of the video was posted. This is the angle that, of course, everybody knows and everybody's seen. But the new angle is quite fascinating and very interesting and I think tells a different side of the story. Things that I have picked up after watching the video, and I'm about to play it for you, and we have added captions to the video, and we've zoomed in a little bit on what was happening here. The original raw video has been uploaded to this YouTube account right here, okay? So I'll show you my sources. Please read. This is my own footage filmed from my seat on the plane in the incident, showing more context of what happened before the mf -er is not real. Uh, here's what I think is particularly interesting about this moment. Tiffany Gomas was clearly fighting with another passenger. See what happens after this. See what happens. See what the F happens, she says. I don't give an F about any of my S, talking about her personal items on the plane. And then she says, I'm not sitting by that man and it's unclear who she's referring to. So she says, I need to get the F off this plane right now. Stop it, stop it, stop it. Okay, she, again, clearly in distress. But this is where things get a little strange. She says, things aren't right. I'm telling you things are not right. Hmm, what an odd, peculiar thing to say. And then when somebody who is an attorney tries to, uh, I think, console and or comfort her. Uh, she is like, do not hold me down. I'm getting the F off. Interesting. So ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, the brand new footage of Tiffany Gomas on the plane. Perhaps it lends a little more context to what's going on. Watch. Let me know in the comments what you think is happening here. Where's your bag? Is your bag? 
So that certainly gives a little extra context for what was going on there. Uh, Tiffany Gomas, we cut that video down just a little bit because there's a, a considerable amount of dead space inside of the original video. Again, we thank this account, Olivia Poe, uh, up, up, uploaded the full five and a half minute video. A, a lot of this video is dead space. A lot of this video is dead space and can't hear or see what's going on. So for your viewing pleasure, we simply cut that those parts out. However, what it, what is clear is that Tiffany Gomas uh, was not having a great was was in distress, right? Was clearly in distress on this flight. Some people have said this could be a medication thing. Some people have said that this could be, um, you know, a, a, like some type of uh, erratic behavior. Um, again, due to potential medication mix up or so on. Uh, whatever was happening, Tiffany Gomez was seeing something, and cl clearly, right? She was seeing something. You'd hear it there in her voice. She was saying, uh, something's not right. This is not right. Something's not right. That MF is not real. Everyone's going to die. <laughs> and, and if you go over here to the police report, you find that, she, that, that they, they said that this was because of some AirPods? No, it was. Like, again, this is why, this is why we're covering this. Because no, it wasn't. The police report said that she's upset because somebody took her AirPod. Come on, man. Come on. Come on. That's crazy. TSA personnel arrived on the scene. This is according to the police report. The airline manager gave Gomas a, a verbal criminal trespass notice, explaining that she was denied boarding and needed to depart the secure area. The rejected passenger was eventually escorted to a non-secure area of the airport, but they did not stop her from trying to go back through TSA screening to board multiple times, the documents say. So this is like, again, peculiar behavior. Police eventually tracked down Gomas in the terminal where she was sitting and waiting for an Uber. Uh, she was given a ticket for a criminal trespass notice, uh, w which she refused to sign. <laughs> and don't, uh, uh, Gomas did not show her ID. The complaint states she was never formally arrested or taken into custody. Through a representative, Gomas declined to give a comment to the post. Uh, and so this also says that she's in the clear because you're not going to find any prosecution over it according to uh, an attorney, uh, a local attorney. So, uh, again, Tiffany Gomas was having a bad day. Uh, did she see a lizard person? I don't know. Uh, I'm not here trying to project uh, on anyone. Obviously, she's created an enormous amount of meme content and uh, some laughter and joy for a lot of people. And she seems to be doing just fine, uh, personally. There's, there's reports that she like went on a cruise soon after this and um, didn't even see all the memes, didn't see any, you know, has just been rolling with it. So good for her. Uh, but we still uh, deserve to know the, the truth about what happened. Uh, in full disclosure, our show has reached out to one of to her representative to say we would love to have you sit down for an interview, and we await patiently because we, the world needs to know, the world needs to know the truth. Are you prepared? Are you ready for the truth? 
It's your boy, Benny. See ya.